Hi, I'm Vince Lockhart. Uh, I've been with Midcontinent Steel & Wire for 26 years. I've had many positions throughout my career here at Midcontinent Steel & Wire. Started as a bulk production supervisor and uh, currently the plant manager where I'm responsible for managing uh, and supporting a great team of people that we have here in Papua Gua. Uh, Midcontinent is the largest uh, steel nail producer in the U.S. Uh, when others decided that they couldn't compete with the imports, uh, specifically from China, they gave up and closed their manufacturing facilities. If we were to close, think about the families that are impacted by that. That's 350 people that have to go find a new job to support their families, so it can be really devastating when a company in a town like this shuts down. My relationship with Diacero began more than 10 years ago in 2012 when Diacero purchased Midcontinent Steel & Wire. Um, when that happened, there was, there was an uneasy feeling here in Poplar Bluff amongst the team because we weren't sure exactly what was going to happen. When Diacero came and, and purchased Midcontinent, word got out that uh, Mr. Raul wanted to increase production to 100,000 tons per year. The nail manufacturing was not going to leave Poplar Bluff. Uh, here at McContinent, we have worked on many automation projects that have been successful by automating some of our process. We have also helped our people to use their skills and intellect to be more productive. We're constantly talking and having meetings with uh, Diacero to share uh, better practices in nail production. And there's constant knowledge uh, sharing, sharing that work both ways. I have no doubt that together with Diacero, we've embraced the concept of industrial intelligence to bring automation and work smarter, and I couldn't be prouder to be part of the Acero.